43-year-old Radish Narain, also known as Bunga, was allegedly beaten and taken to sea against his will, where he died. Crew members are claiming that the man suffered a seizure and jumped overboard, but relatives suspect foul play. Relatives are suspicious of the story related by the crew members since Narain is not epileptic, nor did he ever experience a seizure. They also explained that the 43-year-old man had retired from fishing and had vowed to never return to sea. Therefore, it was strange when they learned that he had resumed the trade. Me, no Bunga is no problem person. He's a good, quiet person. And on that day, I see when the fat up in the shop, them to walk to go to the sea. But the next year, the man dead. So, I want it was just a sudden. A person could just dead just like that. Newsroom was told that earlier this month, two men forcefully collected Narain from a shop, beating and tugging him in the process. And he go road and he buy rum and he catch up on his shop and he color him and he can walk up and he can tell a bush that sure. And he beat him and then he carry go inside the sea. And he tell, he tell, he, the, the boy tell me say, he go never see back show land again. Residents described Narain as a hard worker who would assist anyone in the community. They explained that since he left the fishing work about three years ago, he has been doing odd jobs in the community. When his body was discovered, the crew members were briefly taken into police custody and released the same day. However, amid public pressure, police rearrested the crew members along with the two men who allegedly beat Narain. Five persons are currently in custody as the investigation continues. Davina Samaru, Newsroom.